the change we need because of ecological reasons is, is as big as we needed when the culture changed from agricultural to industrial and so on. And then we thought a lot about transfer, transversal competencies. And these can be compared with so-called 21st century skills, which are very, very well known in the world. And, but to us, they, they seem too economically focused. And remember, here we are speaking about children between 6 and 16. And uh, we th thought, we have thought very much about these transversal competencies, which are suppo supposed to be intertwined into each subject syllabi, meaning 18 subjects about. And here there are some e examples how these transversal competencies are now written into to the to the draft version of the national core curricula. P pupils learn to place themselves in the situations of others. They learn about human rights with an emphasis on children's rights. And actually, three documents are mentioned in the, in the, national, co in the, in the national core curricula. Uh, they are, I mean, documents on human rights. They are universal declaration of human rights agreement of ch uh, children's rights and uh, European agreement of human rights. Uh, NGOs have demanded us to mention these uh, documents and they, there they are now. And somehow the, the human rights approach is very, in many ways, uh, uh, rooted into the proposal. Then in trans, uh, I will go for forward about concerning transversal competencies. Pupils learn to develop their consumer skills. They learn how to be fair, to share, and to act as a responsible consumers. So children between uh, 6 and 16. They also learn to use ICT-based technologies and tools, uh, even in international cooperation, and they learn to judge the implications of their conduct conduct on the net. These are just examples. And uh, there is a very strong uh, focus on participation, influencing and construction of a sustainable future as one of the transversal competencies. And it says, among others, that pupils will learn to plan and assess their studies and learning environments, to participate in the decision making, in, inside the school, but also uh, in civil society, they learn how rules and agreements are made and what trust means. It was mentioned in Helmut's speech that, that this is one, one important aspect in our, our work here. Also, Irmeli mentioned that we, we have very little control systems in education and we consider that one of the reasons of success. And children learn to negotiate, to mediate, to face and solve conflicts. Conflicts. They learn to judge their ideas and suggestions in the light of equity, equality, and fairness. And notice in all this that they are very little about contents because we focus on on what do they learn, and actually in this part, what the teachers teach having in mind that there should be an achievement in the end. And achievements are before all. They are skills and attitudes and will, not so much about contents, because there are so huge amount of contents. It doesn't all fit into the curricula, but it's important that when you choose the content, contents, the contexts are meaningful and they, they matter to children and they are, they are correct.